have no idea what I'm doing. I'm not even trying to do a good job right now. Is 5.15 too late to make coffee? Hey guys, so it is, what is today? It's Monday, the 18th, I'm assuming. So I have been trying and trying and trying and trying and trying and trying and trying for like over a week to start a new reading and slash writing vlog because I'm really trying to produce more content more often and I have a lot of clips but they've all been basically trash so that's where they're all going to go is into the trash hopefully this one will not though so basically I got a new camera I'm super excited I do like the idea of this camera. I have a Nikon Coolpix 6900. What I love about my camera is that it has a flip out screen. So I can stare at this thing, but also know that I'm like in focus and that my hair looks okay and that I'm not cutting off and just showing you my eyebrows or whatnot. So that's been really great. It's just not the quality that I was hoping for. And sadly, it's not even the same quality that my iPhone. My iPhone had better quality. So I've been really, really struggling with this thing to make it work. I was going to film my coffee break video today during this break, but I went over my last one. So I've got to cut my break a little short to compensate so that way my break times throughout the day are on point. So instead, I figured I'd just open up the vlog because I hadn't done that yet. It's been really busy today. I've been working. What is my goal for this vlog? So... We are going to finish The Trophy Wife, and I'm still only writing the teaser. So I'm going to do a better update the next time I sit down with the camera to do some writing or some reading and do stuff. I'll let you know where I'm at and kind of go through my process of writing. But my goal is today, at some point before the end of the day, I want to finish the teaser, which is basically like the first three pages. Almost like, like a prologue for a book almost, but it's not... A prologue right so I want to finish that because it's only the first three pages and I've already written the first like page to page and a half I think um, so I don't have that much work to do on the teaser so what I did is I sat down with my outlet with my planner yesterday I spent so long doing my planner I'll have to show it to you guys in a later clip but my kids I can't really do plan with me anymore because my boys and I do the planning together on Sundays and we have so much fun and they tell me where to put my stickers and they help me with all the stuff so anyways, I decided that every single day I'm outlining how much I have to write that day. So it's not really like tasks to do for writing because I can kind of figure those out on the day before I sit down. But it's more just like, right, hey, this is when I write the teaser, this is when I write the act, this act, that act, and this act. And if, if I stick on the schedule, um, the schedule and deadlines that I made for myself, then I will actually fin finish it by the end of this week, which doesn't put me too far past my goals for this month. Maybe. Anyways, i am got to get headed back now. As I said, I was going to try to cut my break short and I probably did not. But the other thing I want to do in this vlog is I want to finish Bridge of Clay because I've been reading this book for over a month and it's like the weirdest thing. I don't know what it is about the books that Brie recommends for me. They take me forever to read, but they're like my favorite books of all time. So I absolutely adored with all my heart A Gentleman in Moscow, but that book took me forever to read. And the same thing with Bridge of Clay, and that one's a really interesting one because, so Bridge of Clay is actually really interesting because when you sit down to read it, there's such short chapters that a lot can happen very quickly and very rapidly. And so you just want to keep reading and reading and reading and reading and reading. But if I get super busy and I can't read, it's like I don't feel this like panic rush to read it like I do with like a thriller or something. Because I know that Clay's just going to be hanging out of the bridge, <laughs> building his bridge, and the other Dunbar, Dunbar boys are going to be hanging out of their house, fighting each other, and hanging out with a mule. So, I do want to finish it though because I have a lot of arcs, I have a lot of other things to read and write and do, and I just want to move on from the book, but I also love it and I don't mind prolonging it, which doesn't really make any sense. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to stop rambling because this is like the longest intro of all time and I got to get back to work. So, I don't know when I'm going to check in with you. It'll probably be tonight. At some point, I will be doing something else. And this time I'll take you with me. Okay, 
yeah, let's do that. Oh, the other thing is please bear with me with some weird lighting because the lighting in these that I've noticed from this camera has been wonky as heck. Like, it's like I'm a ghost. So I'm trying to do some color grading and really, like, upping the quality. So I want to up the quality of my vlogs, but my fear is that I'm going to bring the quality of these videos down significantly while I learn how to bring up the quality. So I will learn this eventually. All right, I gotta go. This is not how today was supposed to go. It's like almost 8 o'clock, and I'm just waking up, and I start work at 7, because I have a really bad headache, and apparently I overslept through my alarms, and now I'm late for work, and I didn't vlog anything, and I haven't written anything, and my head is killing me, and I look like a dog pooped on me, or a car ran over me. Or some sort of really bad analogy. So I'm just waiting for my phone to turn on because it is dead. And it is charging. So I can text my supervisor and be like, Hey, I suck at life. And I'm a horrible employee. And I feel like I'm half dead. So I'm going to do something with my face. And my head. And I'm going to brush my teeth. Oh, and I did get these. So we order a lot of stuff on Prime now. Um, the Amazon like Prime delivery thing. So I got some food and some coffee stuff to deliver this morning, and I got these new charcoal strips. So I'm gonna do that while I get ready to do my job, and hopefully, hopefully I'll be able to vlog something more because I have not checked in since my intro. Like, oh, I'm gonna be so productive. <sighs> Check in later when I look like a human. So this clip, I'm not even trying to do a good job right now. I don't even care because I am just so excited. So I told you guys that I liked the idea of my camera, but like I didn't like love my camera. Um, it's from like 2014, which is fine, which is totally fine. It's just that some of the lighting stuff was a little off. Um, it just, it's a good camera if this is like what you can get. But I wanted something a little better. I'm with like the super pretty Canon box because it is refurbished. In fact, it's not even in the right box. It says Canon EOS PowerShot Vexia. That's not what this is. This is a PowerShot G7 Mark II. It's going to buy a different one. And then three, when I sent her the one I was going to get, which was a 740HS or something SX. Which, I'm sorry, am I the only one that wants to say SX every time you see that? Anyway, it's the SX. 740 HS um but I she was like no you should just get this one if you can like save up for it and it ended up working out because when I exchanged this one and then I got some rewards points that I can use to cash in for gift cards that I would normally spend cash on so then I kind of feel like I'm paying for my camera with it um that's how I justify being able to do this anyways so I'm going to quickly quickly unbox this but I have to get back to work in just a minute I have one minute <laughs> okay so I open up the box it comes in this pretty bubble paper. We'll play around with it more during like when I have a break or something. I just wanted to open it for the first time with you guys before I play with it. I'm so excited. Okay. Okay, I can contain myself. See, I love that it is still really portable because that's what I liked about the Nikon. Um, but it's super portable. And then this guy right here. Which I like because the Nikon that I have flips out, but I feel like I stare at myself. Like right now, I'm not staring at the lens like I'm supposed to. I'm staring at my face, so I'm probably looking all over the place. So this, I feel like, will make it easier for me to vlog and look at the lens and not at my face. Because I'd have to look up more. Anyways, um, I will play with it a little bit more later, but it's so cute. It's so I like that it is still small, but it will pack a punch. And then the only other thing it came with is like battery and charger and what have you. So I have to get to work now. I'm going to play with this bad boy and then we will do some more clips later with my new cannon. Is 
basically as good a time as ever to start today's section of the vlog. I seriously don't even know how I'm going to splice this thing together. I'm gonna try to edit today um, and like tonight and get this ready to post sometime tomorrow. This was supposed to be a reading vlog and a writing vlog and now I think it's just literally me screwing around with my camera. So whatever, let's just go with it. Today I've got a couple more minutes left on my break. I'm drinking massive amounts of coffee as usual, but I need to seriously clean up this space. It's amazing how I have such a small little space to hang out in and it can get so dirty so quickly. It's, it's a problem. So what am I doing right now? So you can see I'm watching Lexi Alexandra Roseland's video on YouTube and then I'm going to continue working, cleaning up my space. And I want to just get ready for next week. I think next week is really going to be a more productive week when I'm done playing with my camera. And one thing I wanted to do, and this is why I kind of left this video up, is I've had this idea in vlogs for a while that I actually got from Alexandra Roseland during her like Christmas vlogs, I think, where every time she would shout out another YouTuber. And I think that's such a great idea. And I want to do that in every single vlog because I steal ideas around here. Hopefully you don't have too much of a glare. I forgot to take these off. So the first YouTuber that I want to shout out is actually going to be Alexandra Roseland. She is so adorable. She bakes all the time. So if you want to watch videos about with like the sweetest girl who bakes all day long and reads amazing cozy middle grade like she's gonna be your girl so definitely go and check her out i don't know her personally but again like she just seems like such a sweet person like the type of person you just like if you're having a bad day and she give you a hug you would just like instantly feel better and that's what her videos do they're like a video hug <laughs> So I have to get back to work now because I have a feeling I'm probably going over. So I will, I don't know, do stuff, maybe record it, and I'll check in with you at some point before the day is over. <laughs> Um, I don't know what I'm doing with my life. I don't know what I'm doing with this vlog. I don't know what clips I'm keeping and not keeping. Um, all I know is I love this camera. <laughs> so this was supposed to be a writing vlog. I didn't write anything. It was supposed to be a reading vlog. I did not read anything. I do need to get better at looking here and not up here. Um, I will learn this thing. So I have a feeling this vlog is literally just going to be me playing with this camera. I'm probably saying that about a million times. So one thing I do want to do is I want to finish putting together my Kanban board. I only have, and I got about 45 minutes left in the work day. Now to just make sure I don't get a phone call. <laughs> so I made my Kanban boards like two months ago. I even put the goals up there for them. I never actually filled them out. So since I have about 45 minutes left, I think I'm either gonna do that or I've been getting a lot of invitations to read ARCs from, cause I'm on like some sort of PR list for Harlequin Publishing and I get a lot of ARCs from them. And so, but most of them, sorry, I keep having to look away because I have to check my clock to make sure I'm not getting a call. So I get a lot of ARCs from them. Most of them have to be written, read in the next couple of weeks. I'm going to <laughs> probably make a list first of everything that I have to read and try to prioritize my reading. And then if I have time, we'll do the Kanban board. So that way there can be at least some sort of productive aspect to this vlog this week. Um, that and I have to message Quinny back because I, that's the one thing about working from home that I don't love and that's not being able to see my Quinny slash my soul friends she's basically like my best friend but we call each other soul friends because it's like your souls were meant to be together 
in a friendly way. <laughs> anyway, so I have to uh, message back my soul friend and hopefully we will be able to FaceTime. I don't think it's gonna happen right now because we can't seem to get our breaks in line with each other. So I'm gonna have to text her back and then I'll work on that. And then I will see where the rest of this vlog takes us because we're gonna end the vlog some point today and I'm gonna try to splice together all the many things of footage I have from all the different cameras I've used in the last week um, and maybe write a if I read a page I can call it a reading vlog or if I write one page I can call it a writing vlog right Anyways, I'm gonna put my headset on because I'm going to get a call like any second now <laughs> Is 5.15 too late to make coffee? But I feel like it can't be my channel without there being more coffee. Like I have to feel like I have to have this in my hand at all times. Okay, let's grab the planner. My heart, when you ring my Valentine, someday you make my dream come true. So I'm going to go ahead and just end the vlog here. I've been editing all day long and working all day long and drinking coffee all day long. Is anybody surprised? I was going to get all cute and do an outro or like end the vlog and I just don't even care. This has been such a weird mess of a vlog but thank you for bearing with it. I hope it ends up looking okay. And then I think I'm going to be able to keep the clip where I talk about the other youtuber that i want to shout out or kind of mention or talk about in every video but alexander Roslin is adorable um so again if you just want to watch the movie that is full of class and baking and hufflepuff vibes check her out she is adorable i will leave a link to her youtube channel down below but you're probably already subscribed if you found my channel anyways <laughs> um anywho have a great day week whatever this is so remember go write some words and read a book and i will see you guys later thanks for watching please subscribe to my mom thanks for watching subscribe to your mom